Welcome to GED Math in 30 Days. Listen, I was searching the internet uh, last night and I found something amazing. In Google now, they provide practice problems for you. So for example, if you notice uh, on the screen, I have find the slope from two points, practice problems. That's what I typed into Google. And it comes up with practice problems. A straight line has an equation 8y equal 4x plus 21. Which of the following is true? Okay, so what we realized that it's not in standard form, so we got to put it in standard form. So minus 4x plus 8y equal 21. Our slope is 4 over 8, which is 1 half. And our y-intercept is 21 over 8. 21 over 8. So we look over here, the y, uh, our slope is 1 half. We're looking for a slope of 1 half, which is these two options here. And then our y-intercept is a, we have as a fraction, we have as a decimal, but uh, 8 going to 21, two times, um, that's 16. We have five left over, so 0. 0.675. I guess they rounded off, so I don't know what they did there. So we were just going to pick our answer here. Let's see, let's try this out. Slope is 0. 0.5, y-intercept is 2.6. And we got it right. Look at that. That is so, so amazing to me. I just found out. Uh, last night. Uh, let's try something else. Let's try um, percent practice problems. Let's see. Let's try percent practice problems. Wow, look at that. Not only do they have practice problems, but they got multiple sources. Like here's, here's Kahoot. To change the decimal to a percent, you want to multiply it by 100. Submit. Right. Let's check CK12. I love CK12. CK12. Now that's a little bit, that's, that's says chemistry and percent composition. That's a little bit too hard right now. We'll go back to Kahoot because we're for our GED. Let's try the next problem. Look at that. What is 16% of 50? Wow, look at that. So we, wow, wow, wow. Mm, mm, mm. That is so, so amazing. So, so amazing. That's so, so amazing. Mm, mm, mm. That's just, wow, amazing. Let's try something else. Let's try ratio and proportion. Let's try ratio and proportion practice problems. Ratio and proportion problems. Practice problems, hit return. Wow, look, this is amazing. Google, now you can search for practice problems. Wow. In a class, there are 30 boys and 12 girls. Let me get my pen. Uh, determine the ratio of number of boys to girls. So again, boys to girls, boys is first, so 30 to 12. We want to reduce, we know three, uh, we know six can go into both of them. So six goes into 35 times, six goes into 12, two times. So it's five to two. Now they put zeros here, but we know what that is, five to two. Let's check it. Wow, wow. Listen, so that's GED math for 30 days. I just wanted to share this with everybody that you can use Google to practice, I mean, search for practice problems. And they give you multiple sources to practice practice problems. So um, that's a wonderful thing. So signing off, hope you enjoyed this short video. Thank you.